said about it, I bet. And about nothing you do, child. And, and, and I'll go to the door. I'll go to the door. Ashley Bird, I'll go my dad. Bring one, two, three, one, two, three, one. And here, listen. And another test. Mm, I'm gonna test one. Hold on, one second. A little bit of just national economics because everything that's going on in the nation is, is we're, a, we're a microcosm of that here in Texas, so we're seeing it. We're officially in a recession, so if anybody asks you, uh, you, can, you can talk knowledgeably uh, <laughs> or, or more or less sound like an economist, but you know what you're doing, whether you do or don't. Uh, Second quarter of this year, worst on record. A couple of months, April and May, worst on record. Uh, I, I took the other quote that don't have a clue. And for those of you who were like me back in April and so forth, and were watching the daily press conferences uh, from the White House on the on the virus, and you had, you had Dr. Fauci, and you had Dr. Uh, Burns, and, and 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 of course the president, and vice president were there. And, and one of the reporters asked the president what his econo economic advisors were advising him. And he kind of looked at the reporter and he said, they don't have a clue. And I thought that was one of the best answers that I heard in the entire press conference sequence. But anyway, uh, and he, he was exactly correct uh, what, he, what he said. NBER, the National Bureau of Economic Research, which is an organization of economists, uh, has a subcommittee that does market cycles, and they are the ones who officially uh, earmark and say we're at peaks, we're at troughs, we're in recession, we're in boom, you know, we're expansion. They officially announced here a few months ago that February 2020 was the peak month of the recovery from the Great Recession that we had back in 2007, 8, and 9. So after 128 months of continuous economic expansion, uh, uh, almost unprecedented growth.